Hey guys, welcome to today's video. We are gonna talk all things health, wellness, fitness, body care. I have a body device. I have snacks. I have fashion. I have things to try on, which we're gonna do a little bit of that. We're gonna do a field trip to the closet and do the try on thing. And there's just so much going on here under the health wellness category, which I am loving. I am living. I am thriving. I am getting muscular. Things are changing. And I am so pleased with the progress that did not happen overnight. So I wanna state that number one, but just with the small changes that have given me really big results and I wanted to chat about them because you guys blow up my DMs with a lot of the same questions and I love that, but it's easier for me just to kind of sit down and kind of dish into some of my favorites outside of beauty. So grab your water or your disgusting aloe that tastes like actual asphalt, rubber, tire. Like, I don't know how to make this good. It kind of tastes a little dirty, but the things that it does for your skin, aloe, cheers. Mm. And then some H2O, which I'm going to salt with my Redmond Real Salt. If you know, you know, get your minerals in. I just do a little couple of dashes and I feel like the water tastes better. I do have filtered water. I'm all about water quality. There's so much you can learn about water. And then if you wanna be weird with it, you can get into water consciousness, which is a whole different thing, but fascinating. I love being hydrated. I think that is health wellness, like mental mind wellness, number one stay hydrated, do not skip out on the water and make sure you're drinking water that has minerals so that your cells can properly hydrate. That is something to research as well. Cheers, we are more is more, very juicy and hydrated. Let's talk about toning the arms. Oh my gosh, first I have to say, she was outside a little too close to twilight time without a band or a mosquito spray or anything in here in Texas. It's like they see me and sense me and they just like swarm me. And of course you never feel getting bitten by a mosquito, but the mosquitoes here are just outrageous. So I literally had one, two, I think I had like five mysteriously show up on my left arm. They're trying to heal right now. This is not from the device that I'm about to speak on. So now that we have that out of the way, let's talk about Medicube's newest launch. You guys know I have been a massive fan of Medicube. I've worked with them before. This is not a new relationship. We are like a lifelong affair in my opinion. I love this brand. I still use their skin tools and the new one that they have is not for the face, it's for the body. And it gives you the results that are just like, oh my gosh, did you just spend $5,000 at the medical spa? Because not that I wanna admit this, but I have done those more expensive treatments at medical spas back in LA. It's not really a part of my day-to-day -day here in Texas, but I still want my skin to be tight and right. I wanna reduce cellulite if I can. If technology is out there that's gonna do it for me at home, Sign me up, I'm into it. And I really believe in Medicube's technology. So here we have this potent, I'm gonna unplug this little guy for a moment. This is not a chargeable device, which I love, by the way. It packs a punch. It actually needs that much charge and electricity that you are gonna have to plug this in. This is Medicube's HR Contour Body Shot. And I think this is so cool. I have never seen anything else for the body on the market at home, easy to use at home that does what this does. So this uses suction and heat. It kind of feels like you're getting like a hickey, it kind of like suctions the skin a little bit. And then you hear this very futuristic robot noise and it ding, ding, ding. And then you feel a little bit of vibration and heat. And what this is gonna do for your skin is firm it and it's going to encourage new collagen production. As we age, we lose the turnover of our cells. Collagen is not rapid firing as it may have once when you were a baby. We kind of just lose it over time. And this is the kind of technology that's going to encourage it to come back. And I've only been using this for about a month 
So I am gonna update you guys. I feel with a body shot or any body product, you do need to give it a little more time for those overall results to kick in. This is something that with consistency, you are gonna see a change in the firmness in your skin. This is not about being a particular body type. Live where you feel best, be in your lane of that. Appreciate your body for the changes that it may go through. I know that's kind of what I'm dealing with. I've been heavier, I've been thinner. Where I'm at right now, I'm really focused on just being healthy. If there's something that you don't like that you wanna firm up or you wanna improve the quality of your skin, like go for it. So this is something that's not going to melt off fat or you know change your shape overnight. This is just going to firm you. There is a mild mode and there is a more intense mode that you just hit the power button kind of to toggle back and forth. The mild mode I use on my arms. Do not use the strong mode on your arms. It is not for that part of the body, so be sure to read the directions and do not go thinking like, hey, quicker results if I just go like full steam straight away. This is not the kind of device to do that with. Work into it, start on those lower levels, see how it feels, and then move in to something a little more intense. But I would recommend with the arms always staying with that uh, more mild setting, which is blue, strong, red for your thighs or your stomach. So the trouble spot on my arms for me is right here, here, like this, this whole thing. Um, I'm looking for improvement in, do we wanna talk about cellulite on the arms? Cause that can happen genetically. I feel predisposed to a little bit of that. So I love this kind of a thing where I actually see a toned difference and the skin looks prettier and tighter and I just, mentally feel like a little more, which working out, it doesn't matter what you do to work out. You're not gonna change the quality of your skin through just lifting weights. So I do wanna say something like this can be really beneficial if you are in a transformation era of your life. I also follow up after treatment with the HR Vita K cream. This is beautiful. This has Arnica, this has vitamin K. It's gonna reduce redness. It's also going to reduce inflammation. Arnica is great for that. This also has niacinamide in it as an ingredient to brighten and this helps any bumpy texture on the skin. You can even use this on the face kind of shocked me. I've only used this on the body, but I love this. It just firms the skin up beautifully. I'm gonna pop some on my arms right now. It has a very fresh, subtle, light, bright fragrance. And this one absorbs so quickly. It's really luxurious. It feels so nice and fresh and is so complimentary to this device right here. You can get this for free as an add-on. There is, of course, a discount code TATI40 for 40% off, and this will work on the other devices as well. This will not be here forever. We are going to end this promo on the 7th, so grab it while you can, 40% off. It's a one-time investment. Check back in with me because I am going to transform my belly button. That is the goal. Why? I just want to. I actually remember this is the weirdest thing to say to someone. James and I, maybe on like our second or third date, we were like just talking and he asked me, he's like, what do you think is your prettiest body part? I don't know why I said this, but I was like, oh yeah, my belly button. And he's like, oh, interesting. And I thought I was being all cute, like, yeah. Because I used to have a piercing and I thought it was so cute. And these days it's just like a little, little frowny, like I'd like it to be more like this. Um, I'm being very real with you guys. Thank you for indulging me in that. Thank you to Medicube for sponsoring this video and for partnering with me once again, even though my channel can get a little crazy. A little oversharing here on my channel. It is what it is. Now I wanna share with you guys a couple of snacks. This will be really weird and random and then we'll go into the closet and I'll try in a couple of new things that I bought for my fitness journey. Like it's kind of like everything fell apart at once and I was like forced to actually go and purchase black leggings again. I did get some neon ones, so we'll see how that goes. I haven't tried them on. We're gonna check it out together, but let's talk about healthy snacks for a moment. So one of the best things that I did for my health over the past year and a half is cut out seed oils entirely 
regularly with the exception of if family is visiting or if there's an event where I'm out at a restaurant, it's truly unavoidable. Like my stomach bloats in ways that you normally don't see. So I expand and then I contract and then I expand and it's just kind of been like this lifelong struggle. I just love how I'm eating these days. I love how I'm caring for my body. It feels good. I feel healthier than ever. So if you're on the no seed oil train, you understand it's so hard to buy a bag of chips and not look at the back and be like, ugh, canola oil, palm oil, and oh gosh, you know, what do we got here? We got sunflower seed oil. So I order these online. These are the Masa tortilla chips, and this is organic corn, grass-fed beef tallow and sea salt, and that's it. And I will do like guacamole. I will do kind of a meal out of these. They're really the most high-end luxury potato chip you can purchase. If you go to Sprouts or Whole Foods, you can pick up these from Boulder Canyon. They are the avocado oil, classic sea salt. I personally like simplified ingredients, so this is the variety that I go for. Um, so this one is just potatoes, avocado oil, and sea salt. Love these. This is my indulgence. How I feel my best these days is fruit and protein and occasionally some raw cheese. I'm careful with dairy. I'll do kefir and smoothies. I'm all about healing that gut health. It's a process, a journey, and I'm still in it and on it. I don't do full-blown carnivore intensely anymore. Like I was doing that where I was just like steak, eggs, steak, eggs, and like I needed to branch out. And I think that's the beautiful thing about learning what works for your body is feeling it out. And if something is not working, you can shift. And I'm not for or against any one type of eating. I just think we all have authority over our own selves to make those choices. But I still have those moments where I want a chip and I want a cookie. I want something sweet and I do not believe in denying yourself, but if you can find a better option, why not? So my indulgence right now that feels not really like an indulgence because I know there's a lot of nutrients in here and it's doing some good things for my body as well is from Honey Mama's. This is the salted almond cocoa truffle bar. Really beautiful ingredients. You have to keep this refrigerated, but it feels like you're eating straight fudge, but in your mind, you're like, this is not gonna wreck my gut. This is not super terrible. So if I'm watching a movie or something and I have that chocolate craving, I love these. And then the most random, but I've turned so many people onto this. This is the Freak Flag Organics Chicken Tortilla Bone Broth. If you like spicy and you just want some, like I chop up some vegetables and I kind of make it like a tortilla soup, but I don't put the chips in. You can throw some chicken or steak and it is just like a high protein, delicious broth. Oh my gosh, like I want this right now actually. The ingredients literally are water, chicken bone broth, cumin. I always say that wrong. A bunch of spices and uh, it's all certified organic. And this packs, the whole container has 17 grams of protein. I'll usually, okay, I'm not gonna lie. I'll have the whole thing sometimes, but I'll make like a big bowl of it. I'll even crack an egg in it and it'll just be like a big protein, delicious, yummy, cozy meal. And the flavor of this is just, so good, it's so good. All right, so let's talk clothing. I am wearing a little aloe. Okay, this is meant to be more high up like this. In this segment, we're gonna chat about how all hoodies do not hoodie the same. I have no time for a hoodie that does not have a big hood. Like I wanna feel like Belle from Beauty and the Beast in the forest, like about to be rescued as she's like thrown off her horse. That is the vibe that I am into. That was my favorite movie as a child to like a nauseating obsession. Like my whole family was like, we're worried. You got the sheets, the video game, the game cards, the dolls. It's all you wanna listen to. That was my childhood experience loved it. And I had an obsession with hoods ever since. Okay, so uh, this is the cutest little outfit from Aloe. Aloe is expensive, but I do have to say this, their 
quality is through the roof and it lasts. I don't like buying stuff all the time. I'd rather be like, I'm in, I'm out, I'm good for a hot minute. You know what I'm saying? I'm also totally guilty of being a rinse and repeater. You guys have probably seen this very hoodie in gray and in green in so many end of the day checkouts on my channel throughout the years. It's actually a men's hoodie, which I highly recommend. Go into the men's section and go get kind of an oversized hoodie and thank me later because James was just like, please stop stealing all of my stuff. And I'm like, okay, I, I'm, I'm done. I'm gonna go buy it myself. So this is an aloe hoodie that is just like kind of this soft, beautiful kind of fleecy fabric in navy and I was like this will be so pleasurable to wear once it's not 10,000 million bajillion degrees outside and just look at like oh look at that hoodie it's like a nice big hide me from the world I will be living my beauty and the beast fantasy in this hoodie for sure I did it I got flared leggings that are low cut. You like fold them down. And James really encouraged me with this one. Okay, this is the first time in my life that I don't have a total pancake booty. I have been lunging, I've been building up my thighs, I have been eating well, and I feel like I deserved new things. And these are so flattering. Like now that I have a little bit of a curve, like if I'm being honest, it's not much. But my husband is very encouraging of this. He's like, those look great on you. You look better than ever. Oh my gosh. And I was just like, yeah, all right, let's do it. These are the Aloe Soft Low Rise Foldover Boot Cut Legging and they fit like a dream. I feel like I'm back in jazz class or something. This was one that James was like, that's kind of weird. I don't know about it, but I love it. It's like sweatshirt material, but a sports bra. And I was like, dude, I'm just gonna like wander around the house in this and shorts. And this is not even really to work out in. I just felt really cute in it. It is the scoop neck sweatshirt bra. I also picked up this really fun thick strapped cross back situation. I always find that I just go to like black leggings, a black sports bra, and I just feel my best in it. But this is a little more dressed up in the back. It's like a really thick, nice material. And I thought it was really cute on. This is the emulate bra. And then now we're gonna go over to Lulu. I'm a little bit concerned, okay? I bought this size four. I'm really tiny right here, and then things like kind of fall out and get a little bigger around here. Uh, so it's hard to find the right fit with sports bras and just bras in general. Okay, so this is the prettiest color ever. This is like my, if I'm gonna do a color, this is like the fantasy color. I put this on and I was like, is this a child's bra? Like what is going on here? Like this is a size four? I just picked it off the shelf and I was like, oh, I'll stretch myself in here. And like, literally I was telling James, I'm like, you are so lucky. I would like to see you put on a sports bra, just like the struggle, like getting it like off your face and you're like, and like getting it on is one thing, taking it off and like, you know, and like, it's like second workout. Um, This was an extreme situation and I ripped the tag off before I tried it on. Tag still on this one, I have concerns. I thought this was like, I don't know. I was like, well, I'm not a size like zero, one, two, three. Like, let's go with four. That makes sense. I'm not experienced with Lulu. Let me know your thoughts. What do you guys like from the brand? I also wanna try the Inspired by Buttery Soft line on Amazon. Who is she? Who do I think I am? I'm a little scared to try these on, but we're gonna do it. Let's take a look in the closet. I'm modeling them right now for you and I'm probably going, why, why did I do this to myself? Oh my gosh, I should have just got another pair of those cute flared ones, but maybe they'll work. Leave me in the comments below. Do we like, do we love? Are we into neon? Let me know. And because I live in the accepted land of being basic, like I own my being basic sometimes. So I bought the black Align leggings. I really like the long ones where, I don't know, I just feel like they're more flattering. Where they go really close to your foot, like they almost like cover up the ankle, like they're just super long. My other ones were literally falling apart. And then I got a backup. Okay, that's not that exciting. Also, I just wanna say the moto leggings from Aloe, I endorse those a thousand percent. I still have mine that are like four years old and they're still great. 
they're still super great and they still sell those. It's kind of like an iconic aloe item. If you're looking for something really sturdy, really cute that will last, they last longer than the Align pants. I also wanna mention my weights are from Target. So is my yoga block and my mat is Blogilates. I finally upgraded from the Target black and white towel to an actual mat, yay me. But I am still working out in my closet. I love working out in there. I will list below the workouts that I'm currently loving. I am still so here for Carolyn Gervin. Her channel is amazing. Her programs have really helped me to actually put on muscle and I'm doing it myself. I'm not working out with a trainer which is super rewarding to see really big results. And then Alani Fit for Pilates and Mad Fit, I believe is the other one that I like for kind of a mix it up, a little more stretchy, a little more cardio hit kind of a thing. So you can totally change your life, your routine, your body, your energy, just how you feel in your skin at home on your own. We don't need to go to the medical spa. We can do it ourselves at home. We can lunge and lift and follow a free class online, which is awesome, which is all I've been doing. I do not belong to a gym. And then just make really good choices to hydrate and just get something nutrient dense in your body. And these things will just all work together harmoniously, change the game, take your vitamins, take your halo. That is my update of favorites and new fashion whatnot in the fitness health wellness realm. I hope you guys enjoyed this very different video. I hope you go and check out the new device, the HR body shot device that has RF and EMS. Anyone can use it. It's really user-friendly. So go and check out the website. Use the code TATI40 for 40% off. You can use that on other devices as well. That code is here for a limited time. It will be ending on the 7th. So go and check that out while it is still active. I will list everything you need and the link to the site in the description box below. Thank you so much Medicube for sponsoring this video. All right, there you have it. That is it for this video. Thumbs it up. Make sure you are subscribed. Ring the bell. Other than that, be healthy, well, and fabulous. Go have a good one and I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Mwah.